okay now uh, students here we will discuss about the number one point that is diversification of diversification of crop productions so diverse in diversification of crop productions it involves shift from single cropping system to multi cropping system so diversification of crop production means single crop system to that means the farmers now produce single crop <coughs> single crop to multi crop multi 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 crop multi crop systems okay that means now farmers not depend on only one single crop now they produce different types of crops they produce different type different types of crops next there is a need to encourage the farmers to take up cultivation of a wide variety of crops so in this passage we have to encourage the farmers it is written here that we have to encourage the farmers to take up some initiatives to to produce a variety of crops if they produce variety of crops then their uh, dependence on a single crop will reduce then the dependence on a single crop will reduce that means the risk that uh, they bear every time will severely reduce if they produce variety of crops and that is the important of multi crop systems and that is it is written here that we have to encourage the farmers to take an initiative to cultivate variety of crops multiple cropping system reduce the dependence of farmers on one or two crops as they are engaged in growing a wide variety of crops so uh, what is the importance of multi crops the multi cropping system reduce the dependence of farmers on one or two crops so multi cropping systems reduce the farmers of one or two crops that means prior the farmers are basically producing only one or two crops in a year now they are producing multi uh, multi crops that means they are now producing various type of uh, production in their fields and that is why they are growing uh, their production is uh, day by day growing in uh, in his field it will also raise their income so if their production increases definitely their income also increases in in india agriculture is still dominated by subsistence farming so in india basically we see in rural areas in india the farmers are basically depend on subsistence farming subsistence subsistence farming what is subsistence farming subsistence farming means basically they produce basically they cultivate those uh, uh, products which are for their subsistence that means for their livelihood the in rural areas the farmers basically produce those goods which are uh, required for their subsistence that means which are required for their livelihood and still these subsistence subsistence farmings are dominated and farmers give a prime importance to the cereals in the cropping system and still now the farmers give more importance to the cereals that means uh, pulse rice wheat okay this type of uh, crops they basically produce in their fields because these uh, uh, these crops are related to their livelihood these crops are related to their subsistence for their survive and that is why they produce this type of subsistence farming now the importance of diversification of farming is diversif diversification involves a shift in cropping pattern from food grains to cash crops so what is the importance of diversification of farming diversification of farming learns the uh, teach the uh, farmers that they should shift their uh, cropping pattern from food grain production to cash crop productions cash crop productions will earn more income cash crop if they produce cash crops to uh, food grains it will uh, increase it will uh, it will raise their more income and that is why it is written uh, it is written here that diversification involves a shift a shift in cropping pattern from food grains to cash crops so why they will shift their uh, pattern of cropping in food grains to cash crop because cash crop will uh, increase their more income okay and the last line is basically the main aim is to promote shift from subsistence farming to commercial farming and that is why this is the main aim of this chapter 
to promote we have to promote the shift of subsistence farming to commercial farming that means if they produce multi cropping systems multi cropping uh, uh, systems if they produce multi cropping system if they pr produce varieties of crops then definitely their subsistence farming will be changed and they will come to a commercial farming so prior they are basically producing subsistence farming that means they produce only those goods which are needed for their daily life but now they promote their subsistence subsistence farming but now they promote to shift their subsist subsistence farming subsistence farming to commercial farming okay and this commercial farming will earn more income in their life in the next we will discuss about the diversification of productive activities that means the second point the diversification of productive uh, productive activities okay and there are several points we will discuss one by one